Hello everyone, welcome to Math is Fine. Our lesson for today is all about solving problem involving direct proportion. Our first problem. For every 40 kilometers, David's car consumes 4 liters of gasoline. If he drives 280 kilometers, how many liters of gasoline will his car use? This problem is a direct proportion because as the distance increases, the number of liters of gasoline also increases. Let's analyze and solve the problem. What is asked? In this problem, it is asking for the number of liters of gasoline. So, let's make a proportion. We we'll read again the first statement. For every 40 kilometers, David's car consumes 4 liters of gasoline. So first is we're going to make a ratio. Kilometers to liters. And for the second ratio also, we start with kilometers to liters because this is a direct proportion. So for every 40 kilometers, David's car consumes... 4 liters of gasoline. If he drives 280 kilometers, how many liters of gasoline will his car use? So, we put here N as our variable to represent the answer. Then, we're going to multiply the extremes. 40 times N is equal to 40N. Then, we're going to multiply also the means. 4 times 280 is equal to 1,120. To get the value of n, we're going to divide 40 both sides of the equation to make the equation balance. So 40n divided by 40 is equal to n. 1,120 divided by 40 is equal to 28. Therefore, our answer is 28 liters of gasoline. We're going to check if our answer is correct or not. We're going to substitute the value of n into the proportion. 40 is to 4 is equal to 280 is to 28. Then we're going to multiply the extremes and the means. So... 40 times 28 is equal to 1,120 and 4 times 280 is equal to 1,120. It means that our answer is correct. I hope that you understand our lesson for today and thank you for watching.